Okay, so um, this is the Terex Process Pilot Plant, and uh, while this is really primarily focused at reducing the biosolids from the wastewater treatment plant, it's got um, an, a whole other level of value that's, that's really quite interesting. Secondary value is really around um, recovering uh, elements like carbon, nitrogen and uh, phosphorus. And the way that we think about that is that the biosolids that we start with are this really complicated mess of, of these elements wound up in this organic waste. And so we can recover that carbon as an acetic acid or a vinegar, the nitrogen as an ammonia, so it's a very sort of clean and, and um, inorganic ammonia, and, and the phosphate as a, as a solid inorganic phosphate source. Um, so in terms of the carbon, uh, that has many other applications. Once we've got this simple carbon molecule, we can, it can be put into uh, bioplastics, biofuels, even de-ices and the like. Ammonia, that it's, uh, you know, a lot of fossil energy is used on producing ammonia and then we spend a lot of fossil energy at wastewater treatment plants at the other end of the process actually um, treating that ammonia, stopping it getting into our environment. So this is an opportunity to recycle that nutrient so we're not starting from scratch. And phosphate's an even scarcer resource, it's non-renewable. Ammonia you can pull nitrogen from the atmosphere, phosphorus you can't. Wastewater treatment plants are one of the few places you can actually um, concentrate up phosphorus. Um, and so the ability to take phosphorus um, and recycle phosphorus has, has got some really exciting longer term potential.